the Ticonderoga class cruiser. Origin, USA. Cost, $1 billion. Weight, 10,000 tons. Length, 567 feet. The Ticonderoga class isn't just armed to the teeth. The lethal weapon systems are allied to the most advanced sensor systems in the world. A terrifying combination. Now this is a fantastic ship. It projects the most maritime firepower in the fleet. It is an incredibly effective weapons platform. In the right context can be the turning point in the battle. A Ticonderoga class is fitted with two vertical launching systems that can carry up to 127 munitions, from Tomahawk cruise missiles to the Precision ASRock anti-submarine warfare rocket. We have enough firepower to take down any ship in the world. Ticonderoga class ships are also armed with two powerful five-inch cannon, which can destroy enemy shipping or obliterate ground forces. Five is gonna shoot 20 of these per minute, 80 pounds a piece. Anything on the other side of this gun is gonna be devastated. The devastating effect of so many projectiles in such a small space, that's so much firepower that it's completely overwhelming. If the enemy fires back or gets too close, the Ticonderoga is equipped with close-in weapon systems to deal with any incoming fire. We have the Sea Wiz, which I think is one of the scariest guns ever made. 75 rounds per second, six-barrel Gatling gun. the Ticonderoga's devastating destructive capabilities. It employs the multi-million dollar Aegis Combat System. This state-of-the-art computerized command and control system is based around the SPY-1 radar. It can assess threats almost in a sequence or an order. The greatest threat will be the one that is moving the fastest, the one that will approach you soonest. The threat assessment is done in fractions of a second and targeting and tracking info updates every millisecond, giving Ticonderoga total command of the battlescape. 